just before we started filming, we were talking to a student that just had their driving test and unfortunately mm -hmm. they failed their driving test for this junction, yes. didn't they? they did. So we're gonna go there, I'm gonna show you why she failed, tell you so that it doesn't happen to you on your driving test. Buckle your seatbelts and strap in for an intense drive as Desmond does his mock test. Any advisory driver thoughts will be up here in yellow and any serious or dangerous driver thoughts up here in red. Let's get ready. Welcome back to day crew. Desmond's doing his adjustments in the car because yes. it's his turn to do a mock test. Now, he's actually got it super easy. <laughs> I was pushing him to do somewhere else, but Desmond's got his heart set on. He's probably most favourite test yeah, centre. Yeah, West yeah. Wickham, yeah so West Wickham. So everybody, yeah. just in case you don't know, this is Desmond from yeah. Decide to Drive. Yeah. He also does the intensive courses. If someone's looking to do a two-day intensive course, this is your man in the manual car, yeah. which is that one right in front of us there. And Desmond, fill us in. So how do you know this area? What's your history? Give us your spill. Okay. Um, West Wickham is a suburb test centre. It's brilliant for learning. The roads are nice, open junctions, um, got different various routes, a few 40s. Um, there's no faster roads than 40 miles an hour. And basically, yeah, I've been driving around here. So I've been teaching for 27 years mm -hmm. and I've been using West Wickham for the last, say, 20 years. Decided not to go too many other centres, just mm. to stick to West Wickham. Yeah, so West Wickham is quite yeah. a nice area, isn't yeah. it? I do like the area. Um, not a lot of big roundabouts, you know, just kind of two yeah. lanes. Quite simple. Yeah. All right, we've got a country lane. Yeah. Uh, Desmond's going to do his mock test. We're going to do all the manoeuvres on the mock test. Mm -hmm. We're going to be super strict. And we're going to choose, well, I'm going to choose because I'll be telling Desmond where to go. I'll be your examiner for today. Nice to meet you, Desmond. Nice um, to meet you, And Scott. we'll be choosing the harder routes, okay. which Desmond knows like the back of his hand. So if you fail this, Desmond. Yeah, my dear. There's no excuses. Yeah. In collaboration. Right. That's right. I'm going to have to show you my school to do the two-day pass. <laughs> <laughs> You've got the two in it already. Yeah. <laughs> Won't be a big change. There you go. Right, okay. so this is the spill. Everybody that's doing a driving test, Desmond, read your number plate for me. Okay, it's DR17DES. Are you sure? I'm very sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. So you get a nice sight test to start off with. Then you tell me question. Mm -hmm. So Desmond, can you tell me how would you check to see that your brake lights are working? Brake lights. I would press the brake pedal as I'm doing. Yeah. I can use a reflective surface. I've got no one around. Right. Or if I've got somebody, I can ask the examiner to assist me. Yes. So we can go out, check, make sure your brake lights are working. Yep. Excellent answer. Thank you very much. Right, Desmond, we're going to be driving for about 35 to 45 minutes. I'll try and keep it as quick as possible. We'll be doing all of your manoeuvres, mm -hmm. so probably won't be that quick, but mm -hmm. we'll do our best. Okay. Uh, we'll be doing independent drive, yep. and we will be doing an emergency stop, which you may or may not get on your driving okay. test. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, so if you're ready, what I'd yep. like you to do is drive on, please. Okay, we'll do. Desmond's off to a good start, ladies and gentlemen. He's done his... Only right side blind spot check and not checked his left side before moving away. Now, this is acceptable because if you deem it not necessary because there's no immediate danger on the left, you can get away with not checking the left blind spot. So, there you go. There's some trivia for you. <laughs> the whole video is going to be like this, so you're going to get lots of feedback from us. At the end of the road, Desmond, I'm going to throw him a curveball here. Turn right, please. Desmond's thinking, what is this guy on? <laughs> Where's he taking me? <laughs> you know where I'm taking you, Desmond. Don't act like it's such a surprise. All right, so give us some feedback. Give us some commentary, Des. What are you looking some for? Looking what would you right, teach your learners? Right again, um, just keep defective observation to left and to the right. And I only go when it's safe to do so. Okay. So I've noticed okay. quite a lot of cyclists around this area. Yeah. Especially on the weekends. Yeah, back holidays. Yep. Yeah, weekends. You've got, there's a lot of cycle routes around here. Yeah, and you get yep. them quite commonly yep. at these bigger junctions yep. near yep. the yep. high street and yep. shops and train stations. Yeah, a lot of them are coming from Crystal Palace. They oh, start really? Crystal Palace and come all the way down. Right, okay. So they're on a mission. Yep. All right. We're on a mission as well. So the traffic lights, I'd like you to... Read my mind. Turn right. Yes, yeah. you know it. And why am I telling you to turn right at this traffic light, Des? It's, it's going to be the near side to near side. Near side to near side yeah. turning. Good. Yeah. Anything about the actual timing on the lights that's important for learners here at West Wickham Driving Test Centre? Got the um, timer. There's a number. There's a display unit on, yeah. the, on the 
crossing. It tells right. you, it ticks down from 10 all the way down to zero. Nice. So it gives you time to prepare. You can't get ready. So you've got 10 seconds to clear the junction. Yep. So not a lot of time. No. All no. right. So how many cars would you recommend can wait in the centre of the cars, junction? Two cars, you the okay. third, you wait behind the stoplight. Nice one. So if you want the best driving tips possible, make sure you subscribe, ding the bell, and I don't know what else comes with that, but we all know the spiel, right? There's one guy on TikTok, he goes, subscribe, and the word from our comments, and it's like, and now to get into it, another word from our second sponsor. <laughs> Everyone's doing that online. Yep. Desmond's like, this guy talks too much. No. Right. Talk away. I'm going to put some air conditioning on. This does his right turn in this horrible crossroads, which doesn't give you a lot of time. But nice and empty here, so Des can make it all in one. That was nice and smooth. We were hoping for some oncoming traffic. Yay. Um, we didn't get it. Um, what happens is if you do get the oncoming traffic there and you have to stop and wait in the junction, remember you don't have a lot of time. So as soon as you see the oncoming traffic slowing down to stop at the traffic light, start making progress, right? Yep. Because this main road here that we're currently on will start to get the green light and start to come into that yep. junction very shortly after that traffic light changes That's for correct. you, yeah? So you've got to make progress at that junction as soon and as safely as possible. Ooh. Remember the ding-dong noise only comes on when you reach the speed limit? That's correct. But we're going to watch him like a hawk. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes, yeah, so we have a 30 limit here. The car's showing us at 30 miles an hour, and if we do reach the speed limit and the shot and the car, is showing us that the speed limit is correct, then it's going to warn you by you hearing a warning chime, which can be super helpful. It's saved a lot of people here at West Wickham, uh, especially when you get a long 20 mile an hour road. It was getting ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, kept alerting the uh, student. They stayed in the speed limit, they passed the driving test. At the roundabout, I'd like you to turn right, third exit. Very quiet there, Des. What are you thinking about? I'm a hungry man. You're a hungry man. I'm, I'm a hungry pass. man. I'm I'm pass. I fed him some cherries. Yes. I think he needs more than that. All right, nice there. Good roundabout. Well done. Um, we'll just kind of fill us in what you would teach people about approaching and how to complete a roundabout. Speed and approach. Um, mirror signal routine on approach. So mirror signal, position the car. It's so important to get in position early and bring your speed down as soon as you can. So you've got that early vision, early decision, and you can actually slightly cross in the hazard line because I don't want to give clearance to the parked cars there. And once off the roundabout, check my side mirror, my left mirror, check indicate downwards to let them know where I'm going. I'm exiting the roundabout. Lovely. Next roundabout, I'd like you to follow the road ahead, second exit. Okay. So this is everything Desmond just mentioned, slowing down on the approach. No need for him to change gear. Mirror, mirror signal as he comes towards the first exit to show everybody that he will be taking the second exit. So he's doing his mirrors and signals to exit at the exit before the one he wants to take. Just for some context, the speedometer is not showing the correct speed. It is a bit slow. Desmond stepped over to 42 miles an hour. I did say I'd give him a lifeline, but we're going to record this as a driver fault for use of speed. Should we give him a lifeline, ladies and gentlemen? How about you're quite, no? You're quite sensitive, you know. Ooh, yeah, it's not like a manual. Ooh. Not like a man. No, no. manual. No, not like mm. your manly manual. We've got the feminine automatic here. Got to treat her nice, yeah, smooth. Yeah. A little bit of extra TLC. Sing to the car if you like. Yeah. I had to push the car down, man, to get that support. <laughs> it didn't need to, did it? Mm -mm. It got there. Yeah. It's not a two liter, is it? <clears throat> no. <clears throat> it's actually a Renault. Yes, Renault. <laughs> We're driving a Renault, everybody. Let's pull his badge off. <laughs> yeah, pull the badge off underneath. It's a Renault badge. Um, so, yeah, Desmond's got a two litre, everybody. So, when you saw me driving on um, Desmond's car, uh, you'll see how actually I really kind of like the feeling of the car. And it, Desmond didn't actually, I, I didn't know. So, Devin to, Desmond told me after we stopped filming, it was a two litre. So, that does give a good indication to why the car felt so good and strong and sturdy. Um, really nice drive, actually. I enjoyed that. I don't usually, anybody that knows me knows I moan a lot about manual cars, but it's kind of like, yeah, this is all right. It's a Merc. It's yeah. a Merc. 
That's and right. with the two liter as well, it's nice that you, you don't have to gear up so often. So for people that are learning, oh bloody hell, I have to change gear all the time. Literally one, two and three and you're yep. done in that car, That's isn't it? it? Yeah, yep. which is nice. Okay, uh, when it's safe, Desmond, I'd like you to show me nothing. I'm going to ask you that later. <laughs> okay. okay. No problem. All right. Um, at the roundabout... At the roundabout, I'd like you to take the first exit, turning left, please. Ooh. New Addington. New Addington. Nice and easy. To be honest, I don't know how I'm going to do the independent driving here, because it's been a few years since I've been here. I've forgotten the signs, and we're not using sat-nav, but I'll do my best, ladies and gentlemen. Speed and approach. Good. That's it. And then I'm in there. All right, giving it the Charlie Pig potatoes there to make some way. As Desmond entered the roundabout, there was a vehicle coming, but because Desmond increased his speed, he actually managed to gain distance and not causing that vehicle to slow, stop, or swerve. So that was decent that Desmond's experience paid off, and he knows that he can get the gas. He knows he had an extra bit of speed there because it was still um, the speed limit was still a higher speed limit there. So that was good. Thank you. Right, um, yeah, uh, let us know the secrets about these roads, Des, because this is your neighbourhood, man. So fill in the viewers about yeah. what they need to be so looking this, out for. This is a 30 miles an hour. We just left a 40 miles an hour. Um, a lot of people still try to increase their speed and they can fail here for still doing over 40. Because once you leave a 40 and you return back to a normal speed limit, 30 miles an hour, you find you've got to keep your eye on your speed up. Got to keep your eye on your speed up. I'm gonna, we're coming up to a one way system soon. This is New Addington. Keep in my left lane. Check behind me as I brake. Good. Why? Because a lot of people, you know, when learning to drive, probably wonder what I'm about to ask, but. Why do you check your mirrors when you brake? Uh, that's a very good question. I'll come to that one. Okay. Uh, why do you need to use the left lane there? Why didn't you use the right lane to go straight ahead? Because the highway code says, recommends that once driving, keep to the left. Unless good. you're turning right or pass on the station vehicle. And that's normally marked down as positioning for yeah. normal road driving? Position. Yeah, normal yeah. Driving. Road position. yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, right, the next question's a good one, but I'll come back to that, actually, because that's a fair question. Mm -hmm. I'd like to hear the answer mm -hmm. to that. But first of all, we have a junction here, yep. and I believe it's the third exit straight yep. ahead, please. Parkway. Yep, Yep. just after the shell petrol okay. station. Early vision, early decision, at the right speed. Good. In there. Okay. A lot of people struggle at this roundabout with what lane to use. Okay. So would you say this is a one lane or two lane? It's a uh, one lane. You can okay. use one lane. Yeah. All right. It depends where you position and where you're going. Okay. Excellent. Good mirrors, good signals. Very well timed after Desmond passed the van that was emerging. He put his left signal on not to mislead other road users. So it was very good timing on the signal. Again, signaling at the exit just before the exit you wish to take. Okay. Um, right. So that's nice. Um, and this is the 20 zone that Des Desmond was talking about earlier. And Desmond said that, uh, why do we check our mirrors before changing our speed, before stopping? So Des, what would you say is the answer, fair answer to that question? Because you need to know what's behind you, be aware. Yeah. Just like you know what's in front, mm -hmm. you're slowing down, you need to know that if mm -hmm. something's behind you, that's not about to stop. Yep. You don't want to slow down too much. You may even incre increase and move forward. Yep. Okay, good. So it's mainly to do with awareness, isn't yeah, it? The yeah, more aware safety, you yeah, are, the yeah. safer driver you're right. going to be. Yeah. yeah. Okay, Des, what we're going to do is a second left. So not this one, but the one yeah. shortly after. Yeah. Again, there's the good mirror signal, good timing as well. Just as we pass that first road, Desmond does his mirrors and signals. And that's the order that you would like to do. So like Desmond said earlier, when we were approaching a roundabout, and I was saying, what would you teach your learners? One of those points was mirror signal. Did you say Maneuver. move? Maneuver. Maneuver, yeah. yeah. Okay. So it has to be in that order, doesn't yeah. it? If the mirror signal, we have to, uh, sorry, if the mirror check first, signal second, yeah. and then do your maneuver third. Yep. Yeah. Okay. 
Right, we're going to be approaching another roundabout, and this is where I have made mistakes in the past. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I forgot what exit was the one we want to take. We're taking the second, second. exit That's straight great. ahead. Great. And what we're going to do is take Desmond to the horrible country lane where many people are struggling with their driving test here mm -hmm. at West Wickham. Yes. Lovely looking at the wheels of that vehicle, determining. Yeah. yeah, again, amazing mirror signal. Um, good timing. Check behind me. Very nice. Good mirror check for your change of speed. Excellent. So it's not only West Wickham driving test centres that will, or driving test centre that will have country lanes. You will have country lanes at multiple driving test centres across the UK. Uh, what exactly classifies a road as a country lane, Des? A country lane would be a non-residential area. So you could be actually in a farm, farms or, um, yeah, it's a, it's a, so it wouldn't, it would be a, wouldn't be an A, it would probably be a B road. And no pavements? No pavements, no, nowhere to walk. Yep. So nope. people could be in the road. Yep, check your memories um, and pull out from the van. Very nice mirror check for change of direction. That's my number one religion. Yep. And then you could have uh, horses as well and wildlife. Yep. So yep. we had a, come back over. We had a squirrel run out on yep. here the other yep. day. Yep. Um, what did your student, uh, student decide to do on a 40 <laughs> mile an hour road? Yep. Check the mirror. Then they yeah. check the mirror and, and then they, the they stopped the car promptly. Yeah, yeah. and they saved the squirrel's, squirrel's life. life. They did. We didn't have to do CPR. <laughs> <laughs> okay, at the end of the road, I would like you to turn right, please. Thank you very much. It's a nice open junction, early vision, early decision. Speed and approach is so crucial here. Keep looking like I'm watching tennis, mm. and I'm out. Nice, good. And the speed limit has changed back to 30 miles an hour. Excellent. Very good. New road, new Ooh. that's the one. Desmond's got lots of these little catchphrases and they're really good ones as well. Like I've heard some silly ones in the past, but I like them. And you know what the thing is, I've never heard them before. Like I learned them from you, so yeah, yeah. it's really good. Okay, um, so we're not too far from the start of this country lane, and Desmond is obviously super aware. He could probably do this in his sleep. Um, so it's going to be quite difficult to try and catch Desmond out here. Um, but the country lane's coming out, and this would catch most people out, as we explained earlier. Desmond, would you mind filling in the gaps of why it would be so tricky or more, dem I don't know what the word is I'm looking for, but just tell people what the deal is here, please. Because it's actually an old 40 road, but you drive to the condition. There's no 40 signs, so you don't they actually, changed that. you don't have to, see, there's no 40 signs on approach. The sat nav would probably say 40. So you drive to the condition. Drive to the condition. condition. Common okay. sense would be yeah. So less space, less speed, yeah. less C, less speed. That's and correct. those are yeah. the driving to yeah. condition yeah. rules. Yeah. Yeah. And that works for what's classified on your driving test as appropriate speed. speed. Yeah. It doesn't mean that you need to be doing the speed limit. It's not a target. You don't have to hit it. it you have to drive at an appropriate speed. That's driving correct. to, what was that one? Driving to the conditions. Driving to the conditions. Okay. Yeah. Is that something that the DVSA say? Driving yes. to the conditions. Yeah. To okay. road conditions. That's Go right. On. Yeah. So this is a natural meeting situation. It has natural places that you can stop on the on the left. Passing points. Yeah, because the trees Good. stick out. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So you get the roots of the yeah. trees yeah. really sticking out into the left side yeah. of this road. And sometimes you need to stop because the road yeah. is not wide enough. And you can get larger vehicles on this yeah, road. Yeah, buses can't you? come up here. Yeah, okay. There's an arrow in, warning. Very triangle. good. Yeah. Road now is a both sides. Excellent. Horses. Yeah, see some sheep over there, yeah. I think, as well. Very nice, beautiful so countryside. Down. Less space, less speed. Lovely. Check nice mirrors. little mirror checks. Yeah. yeah, very good. All right, so what are you thinking about here, Des? What's coming around the bends? Right. Um, if any lorries, any vans, any. Yeah. Any farm instruments, farm yeah. vehicles, tractors. How's the condition of the yeah. road? Yeah, some potholes here. Yeah. So it's bringing the speed down if I see anything that might cause my car to dip into yeah. a, a dip. I've seen some huge holes on this road in the past. 
Again, I'm just going to hold back now, just checking my mirrors. Good, and what Des was saying about the dips on the side, it dips yeah. you in, doesn't it, mm -hmm. where you get these the kind of holes, yeah, yeah the, camber. the camber, yeah. yeah. And that happens a lot, doesn't it, when people focus yep. in so yep. much on the oncoming traffic. That's correct. Like 100%, they don't see that yep. when that happens. So just then I, has a, I held the middle of the road because it was safe to do so. That's quite sharp bend, isn't yep. it? Yeah, we anticipate in having to slow down or stop even if there was a large vehicle coming round. I don't know if that's a thing yeah, here, yeah. can that happen? Yeah, like, can. You yeah. said there was buses yeah. or yeah, something. Yeah, buses come up here. Yeah. Yep, got 15% up gradient warning. Oh, wow, 15% yeah. is Little, a lot. Yeah. Let's see if this also yeah. can handle it. Um, 12% is even a lot, but oh. 15, I never saw that sign before. Yeah. It's 15% up. So yeah. you really need to give a lot of gas, don't yeah. you, to keep right. that speed up for this yeah. hill. If you were doing this in a manual car, what gear would you I recommend? I second gear. Second gear, Definitely. okay. This is quite a nerve-wracking road, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Would you say this is one of the hardest roads around this test centre? Yes, this the, the yeah. hard bit's done now. So yeah. this is where we're coming back up to the easy part now cool. as we come into Biggin Hill. Right. Is it always a left at the top of the hill? Yes, it is. It is, okay. Yes. See, back That's the incredibly see? steep hill start here, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. So if you're in a manual car having to do the hill start here, yeah. very difficult. Are we turning especially, left? Yeah, of course. Yeah, turning left, please. But if you keep the car moving slowly, again, it's an open junction, early vision, early decision. You can slip straight in. I choose to stop now because they're moving quite quick. Left, look what I'm going into as well. Don't forget to look where you're going into. Excellent. And this road has variable speed limits it's 30 now, and then it will go to 40, and then 30, and then 40. Okay, so it changes quite rapidly. Very good. Um, that's what we were saying was the second reason for people failing the driving tests. So number one is observations, number two is appropriate speeds. Now we did talk a lot about appropriate speed. Use of speed is another one. Now use of speed, yeah. correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe use, uh, use of speed is usually marked if you exceed the speed limit. Is yes. that yeah. that's yeah. fair? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Um, so use of speed, if people do exceed the speed limit, you'll normally receive a serious driver fall depending on discretion and, yeah. you know, how, how, how long happened. you stay there yeah. for. Yeah. Considerable duration. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, and then what's quite important is when people see a new speed limit, because it works opposites, doesn't it? So if you get a speed up, you yeah. cannot speed up until you reach that sign. Yeah. I felt my driving test yeah. were going 25. Yeah. Just see, like, see, like the sign I'd be saying, it's 30, it's, 30, it's 40. Yeah. But actually, the 40 doesn't begin until... Here, here. Oh right. Okay. But I think they've, I think they've moved the, the marker. Just right. like when we was, we was on the forty, he didn't say forty miles an hour. No. Yeah. So that there with the two signs opposite each yeah. other is a, a, a change of speed, and usually those signs are slightly larger, aren't they? The yes. circles are yeah. larger. Yeah. yeah. That's the size of a, a bin, a bin cover, a bin lid. Yeah. The old bin lids we used to have. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes coming up on the left, there's a pub, and they use this cup, um, cup, the pub car park to do a bay parking. So for traffic light check behind me, bringing my speed down gradually. So I'm braking progressively. Okay, further down this road, I think it's still quite far. We have double roundabouts, mm -hmm. don't we? Now, we do. double roundabouts is another very important kind of situation mm -hmm. um what do you usually find students struggle with at double roundabouts sometimes on the approach they're in the wrong they're in the wrong lane okay so if it's because sometimes if the roundabouts straight ahead and immediate right they might then they should move to the right hand lane earlier an old wallington test center route used to be like that so you would need to position correctly Early, yeah. for first roundabout and then for the second one depends where you're going yeah. good sometimes if you're not in the correct position at the first roundabout it might not be safe to 
tapes, yeah. follow the sat second, nav, or yeah. do the, the second round about the yeah. way that you might be asked to do a scholar Correct. examiner. Yeah. So in those situations, if you have made a mistake and say you're in the left lane when you really wanted to be in yeah. the right lane, yeah. what would you advise your students to do? Then go with the lane you're in and signal yeah. left. Okay. You have to. Yeah. Yeah. Because it'd be safer, yes, right? It would yeah. Be. Yeah. Is that allowed on the driving test, yes, or it would is. you fail? Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. they're not marking you for navigational skills. They're marking you for if you if you turn left and you indicate left, that's not a fault. So they can't mark you down. Right. So you haven't committed the driver fault. Yeah. And you've remained a safe driver. Yeah. So therefore, it's not an issue. No. Okay. Good. Very important. Now, we make that sound like it's just a little thing, but it's actually a huge thing, and it's a big reason why people fail a driving test. Because although they have that knowledge and they, they know that they can do that, yeah. uh, the traffic lights would like you to go straight ahead, which I think might be commonly referred to as turning left, yes. right? Yeah. Okay, so we'll say turning left then, yeah. first exit. Okay. Um, so when people have that knowledge, it's remember, knowledge is power. Yep. If it is... Remembered, were yeah, no indication given. Good, these wheels were turning. So, yeah, I saw that. Yeah, yeah. so a knowledge power if it's remembered and used. And what Desmond was saying there is that he's looking at the vehicle on the right, there was no signal from that vehicle, but you looked at the wheels which yeah. was showing you where yeah. the vehicle was yeah. going. Yeah, and that vehicle's wheels were turned left, and yeah. you were, you were yeah. guaranteed yeah. it was yeah. turning yeah. left yeah. at that point. Yeah. Yeah. So, wheels would you say take a higher priority over signals? Yeah, you have to look at the whole situation. I mean, if the wheels are turning left, you know he's going left, even though he didn't indicate. Good. His position told me what he was doing. Just like if in a company, yep. you've got the CEO, you know his positioning. Yep. The Good. janitor, he's got a different positioning. Yeah, than some are more important, important than others, others, aren't yeah, they? So exactly. I'd say the wheels are more yeah. important than the signals. Signal at that time, yeah. 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 Signals are a good clue, yeah. but you can't really rely on no. them, can no. you? Because no. they might accidentally signal okay. a different yeah. way. Let's check my mirror. So... Check the mirror, cross the line slightly. Good. Give enough room, check mirror as I come back in. Okay, at the roundabout, I'd like you to turn left, first exit, please. Speed and approach, early vision, early decision. Again, you could drive on the bricks if you needed to, so you don't bash into the curb. Nice one. Good, that's something that I would advise my students yeah. also. So you use the actual white circle or that little mm -hmm. paved section. Yeah. It's not going to damage the car. That's correct. It hitting the curb. Yeah. Yeah. And hitting the curb would. would. Yeah. So what's more safe? Safer would be going into the white, slightly going into the right to get a better position when you come off the roundabout. Nice. So earlier we were talking about speed changes, and I said yeah. that I failed my test for going too fast before the change up. Mm -hmm. And this is the opposite of what we just had. Yeah. Was Desmond slowing down early? So that once he reached the speed down sign, 30 at the 30. Yeah, so we went from 30, uh, 40 to 30. Yeah. You were at 30 at the 30, at the 30 sign. Yeah. Just really like important. At the stop line at the stop sign. Yeah, it must be 100% stop. Yeah. yeah. What's the term yeah, for that? Complete stop? Complete stop. Yeah. Must come to a complete stop. Yep. Yeah. Rules not rolling. Nice. Good, nice mirror checks there for change of direction, checking to go around the bicycle, checking to come back in. Uh, we have our double roundabouts. Now, these ones aren't too bad because no. there's only one lane, really, yes. isn't there? Yes. Okay. So it's the first roundabout straight, yes. and the second roundabout turn right, please. Okay. Again, speed and approach. Very Checking nice. To the right, yeah. early vision, early decision. Got a couple of people on my left. Just make sure. Okay. And check mirrors, get the signal. And I'll be coming into a 40 miles an hour. It's nice steering, half a steer. Check mirrors and steer it back round to get my good position in. And then build up gradually up to the speed limit. Check mirrors, new road, new mirrors, new rules. Excellent. Yeah, very good double roundabouts. Now, if we did have multiple lanes, like two lanes, we would have used the right lane on the approach to put us in the right lane to turn right at the second roundabout. Mm -hmm. But there we only have one lane, so it's pretty Correct. straightforward, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Okay, at the traffic lights, I'd like you to turn left, please. Okay. So the bike is there, so I'm going to let the bike go. Okay. okay. No 
some sirens. That's a siren in front. I paid him earlier to do that. So <laughs> New world, new mirrors. We've got the blue light situation. Yep, it's not going to affect us. We're just going to make sure yep. no squirrels come out there on the road. There go. Because policemen might speed up. Yep. Move go over. around the squirrel. Yep, could do. <laughs> That's what he's, how he's been trained. Okay. Check behind me, cars emerge and he stopped out halfway the giveaway line. So I'm still bringing my speed down. I think he's letting people cross the road as well now. I think he's a traffic warden. Okay. That's the reason why you don't let people cross the road. You continue, they will cross when it's safe to do so. Get my speed back up to the speed limit. And the hazard. if we beckon like that person was doing, yeah. you could just see their hand, couldn't yeah. you? Like yep. showing yep. the yep. sign to the signals. Yep. You can receive a serious driver fault for signaling, yep. can't you? Yep. Check on TikTok. Yep. Yeah. Because it's not necessary. Yeah. So if you check the TikTok, you'll see that actually happened. And if you're wondering why I talk about this screw so much, this is the road. Go check out today. Yeah. Pass. Yeah. Today. Pass. At TikTok. And you'll yeah. see what? Save a squirrel's life. Mm -hmm. Right, so, um, Desmond, mm. when it's safe, we we'll do your show me question. Mm. I'd like you to show me how you do a big manly beep on the horn, please. Okay. What the hell was that? I said to you a big manly beep. He goes, I, I didn't <laughs> want to scare the blue car at the junction, so I just gave a appropriate signal. I think you should fail your driving test for that person. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, now, this isn't Corkscrew Hill, is it? No, but this is not. like the Corkscrew no, Hill, no. which is very close to West Wickham it's Driving Test Way. Center. Yep. Um, and Corkscrew Hill, this is Glebe Way, yep. uh, very similar, downhill, depending which way you're going, but usually you start off with driving yep. test, go down there, and there's a bit stop winding. junction, the lady fell down just a minute. Oh, that's the stop that's junction. Yep. Ooh la la. Yeah. Desmond. Shall I take you there? Yes, please. Yeah. Let's take the next road on the left, please. Okay. So, guys, if you are looking to pass your driving test here, then you are watching the best video. We're going to go look at that stop line. Just before we started filming, we were talking to a student that just had their driving test, and unfortunately, mm -hmm. they failed their driving test for this junction, yes, didn't they? they did. So we're going to go yeah. there, we're going to show you why she failed, tell you so that it doesn't happen to you okay. on your driving test. Okay, okay so we're going to go up a little further. Yeah, um, this, is King, this is King's Way. So you could come down both directions on this road, I'm assuming? One direction. Are you going to go this way? One, yep, to All right. stop junction. Okay, yep. cool. And then you would go this way, would you? We would turn. Yeah. Left. Yes. Okay, and you could come into this road from the test centre, couldn't you, as well? Yes. I remember a while back we did another video, and I yeah. remember you taking me down yeah. this road, yeah. and I thought, and oh my we, god. Yeah, and then we turned here with, um, I think it yeah. was the other girl, Abby. Yeah, Abby. yeah, yeah. Yeah, and we did a yeah. we, um, parking. And I remember there was roadworks, and you said, where there's rubble? There's trouble. Hey. Take the next road. Maybe I've given that direction no. slightly early. No, no, All right. no, that's cool. Yeah. Take the next road on the left, please. Cool. Hold oh, it's a roundabout. Oh, no, it's it not. No, it's not. It's before. It's not. Okay, before the roundabout. Yeah, it's before. Turn it's left. a left, left. Because the road is a one way street to the right. So you don't Good. need to look to the right, but you can still check it. Ooh. But the road that we're going into wow. is a two way street. Excellent. This is Gates Green, oh, this is right. Gates Green Road. Wow, so you're turning into two way. a two way, but country look lane. at this, yeah, yep. country lane. Holding the best position on the road. So you really need to peep and creep, don't yep. you, to come round and, and I wanna, turn I'm into I'm going to move to the left now so that my view improves and like, I can be seen. Like it. Lean Good. forward. Lean and look. Lean to the side, yep. yep. Lean to be keen, as we say. Right, okay. I've Lean to be that. keen. Mate, I'm learning so much. Okay, um, See, we're coming check behind there. me. Nice, Hold good mirror check. In. Well done. Very nice. Oh. We've got chevrons here. Yep, taking a high road. The chevrons telling me to go to the right. Yes. Because that's the access road for the properties down on the left. Okay. Okay. But if you went the that way, you'd be all right. Yeah, you just have when to you join it, check, you to check it. Here's a stop, so we're going to turn left. Yep. Yeah. So at the end of the road, turning left. And the reason why the student failed here, Des? They just creep and beat. They did. They, they didn't they come did, to. They roll and emerge. They should have come to complete stop. As I come to complete stop, I've stopped my vehicle. Yep, that's a complete stop. Cool, brilliant. And now I check my left and my oh, right. Oh, wow, and I can see why. Because that's 40 miles an hour. 
I don't know why that keeps falling down. I'm trying to tighten it up. There we go, it should be fine. Thank you, Des. Lovely. So now I can edge forward. So I've done the initial done stop. The complete stop, yeah. Because there's a tree and big oak as causing a blind spot. Cool. Excellent. Yeah, that's a difficult road. It is. So literally, they brought her straight back from that point. She's going straight back to the centre. She's not continued to drive. Since the COVID operation, the uh, test is cancelled or it failed, they bring you straight back. Okay, yeah. Unless you fell towards the end of the test, then obviously they will just continue and bring you back. At the roundabout, take the second exit straight ahead, please. Good. They no signal needed, because what people do, they signal... Yeah. And they leave the signal on. Right. So okay. you can do the lane changer if you know what the lane changer is. Yeah. And I hold my position. Lovely lane Good. discipline. Yeah. Extreme left, like you've got extreme sports. Keep it, keep it extreme into your left. Really nice. Yeah, that's very important because what a lot of students would do is straight line, won't they? Yes. What is straight lining? They don't hold. They start in the left. They go in the middle. They go in the right bit of nick bit of the right, and they come back to the left. Yeah. So we call it a straight line. Yeah, because they don't steer hold left it. and keep yeah. the extreme left. Yeah. A like good technique is sport. would be pretend you're going to actually go left. Turn to the left and then straighten it up, and it puts you into the in a better position to come off the roundabout. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, you heard it here first. Remember, knowledge is power if it's remembered mm -hmm. and, used. and used correctly. Yeah, it's like perfect practice. Mm -hmm. You can practice something a million times wrong and mm -hmm. still get it a million times wrong. So it doesn't practice isn't perfect. It's perfect practice. And perfect. practice becomes permanent. You practice yeah. something. Yeah. That's what and you if, do. You, if you get the right teacher, mm -hmm. you're going to learn a lot quicker, yeah, right? Okay. Yep. So, you know, you can go to the Instagram, watch the people telling their stories to the, at Two Day Pass. You will see it from their mouths. Not me and Desmond, which are driving instructors, which are trying to get rich, right? And get all your money. Listen right. to their stories about how they've paid other instructors thousands and gone through really bad experiences that are sometimes yep. quite traumatic, mm -hmm. you know, and it can scare people yep. away from driving. Yep. Yeah. Right, the traffic lights turn right. <laughs> okay. You notice people, I kept my left lane because nothing said, follow her head, and then yeah. Scott uh, obviously <laughs> asked me to turn right, so I checked my mirrors, my door mirror, and you I did. moved over when it was safe. He did. Over. He's a pro. <laughs> I knew you could do it, that's why I was just like, well, yeah. quick, get in there. Yeah, that's right. Right, we're back to that horrible crossroads, but we're coming yeah. from the other side right. now. Yep. Okay, so we're doing the same crossroads we did at the beginning. And this one's a filter. Right, so that's lovely, isn't yeah, it? What's the filter? The filter light allows the cars to turn right with the on without the oncoming cars coming towards us. Cool, and that so what does that safer. filter light look like? It's a green arrow. Nice. So if you yeah. get a green arrow pointing in your direction, there's a green arrow. Then, then we know go. we're good we to go. go. We don't need to pause. Yeah. Unless we hear a, a emergency vehicle, that's different. Then we have to check out where it's coming from. Nice. New road, new mirrors. New road, new rules. Lovely, jubbly. Right, now we need to go get some manoeuvres done for Desmond. Yes, we do. And then we're pretty much finished. Cool. So let's go crack out those manoeuvres. And what I'm going to do is take Desmond to a really nasty car park. Mm. And he already knows where mm. I'm taking him. And the reason why it's so nasty is because the entrance to it is blind. Yeah, yeah, you cannot see anything in As this you, entrance, entrance yeah. can you? So the like, examiner would actually tell you to um, slow right down and maybe select, depends if you're driving a manual, first gear. But like automatically, you don't need to select first gear. It yeah. does it for you. Yeah. So yeah, first gear is really important if you're going in there, isn't it? Yeah. Because you cannot do that in That's any correct. other gear. No. It's just going to mess up. I had one guy done it in second gear. I don't know how he done it, but he, he did it. He did it. No he did way. It. He did it. The right. Zander was kissing the glass. Kissing the glass. <laughs> <laughs> I hope it was the examiner I, you know, I'm thinking of, right? That yeah. uh, would have been brilliant. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, I just hope. Okay, now I've got to remember how to get there. All right. So uh, we'll about we'll turn right, third exit. All right, cool. Thing I'm with Desmond, didn't I? 
requires a probably would have gone straight. You could go straight and go to the petrol station, turn right again, and then you've got that one way No, no, street. no, I want to approach it okay. from this side, okay. yeah, you know cool. what I'm saying, and to get that left in, because yeah. Yeah. that's the naughty yeah. bit. Yeah. Can you go in the car park turning right as well? They generally take it from the left the side. The left, innit? Yes. Yeah, yes. okay, cool. Yes. That's what we're going to do. Because obviously they're coming from this side of the test room, yeah. Nice. Cool. Bing bong. After a while, you kind of know the speed. You just keep your foot steady. It stays at a speed that is comfortable. I mean, when you start pressing the gas heavier, then you're obviously going to be going over the speed limit. Yep. Ding dong, ding dong. The warning chime. It's there to save you from failing your driving test. And I think it is really, it's such a simple piece of so tech. Let's go, let's go ahead at the roundabout. And yeah. then we'll turn right after the petrol station. Okay, cool. To show them that one-way street. All right. Ah, yeah, yeah. 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 Okay, cool. Okay. Straight to the roundabout. Yeah. Second exit, please. Thank you very much. Early vision, early decision. Good speed and approach. It's a Honda. And on this roundabout, I can actually hold the right-hand lane to come off. Because if you go left deep, you're going to be on the pavement. And the examiners don't mind you holding the right-hand lane. Good. So some inside knowledge there. But in um, the highway yeah. code, it does teach us, very good mirror check for your change of speed. Uh, I'd like to pull over and stop on the left in the safe place. In the highway code, it tells us that every roundabout is slightly different, doesn't it? So yes. you've got yes. to kind of know your roundabouts yes. and that would be very helpful. So you can straight line that roundabout effectively. Yes, and what was really nice, if you watch back, you maybe see this, depends how I edit the video, but Desmond does amazing mirrors and signals mm -hmm. as he comes out and exits mm -hmm. the roundabout. So really safe. So if someone was there, you would have known about it. Right, when you're ready and it's safe, drive on. when you put the gas down, doesn't it? It doesn't play around. So even though it's a 1.3, yeah, yeah. does it feel similar to the 2 litre? No, it's, it's light. I can feel the Turning lightness. Turning right, please. Thank you. I feel the lightness. And we pick up the hatchet marker. It's a bit worn out, but there's a, there is a positioning so important here so the car behind me that see it can pass down my left-hand side. Yeah, so it the needed. position. Position yeah, is very so good important. position. And at the end of the road, I would like you to turn right. I want you to turn right. Okay. So why do people fail here, Desmond? Because they turn on the left side. Yes. The, the system um, says that you must go on the right. Look at the road markings. Look at the yeah. circle. The nice blue arrows order. there on That's that little it. blue circle. And I put there. those there. <laughs> <laughs> I was just teasing him and he yeah, came out of yeah, it. Well, well, well done, Desmond. Yeah. Let's give him a round of applause, yeah, people, because you. he's actually there to help you yeah. and give you these little things that the council isn't doing. There but you go. Really helpful. Should right. the council for that. Yeah. Like, yeah. Um, so, Desmond, because we can go right back that yeah, way, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. All yeah. right. So, I just right want to go all the way around the roundabout. Yeah. Sometimes okay. this can happen on test, can't yes. it? You can yes. be asked to go yes. all the way around. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to do full exit, just yeah. going back the yeah. same way we Will came you? from. Yeah. Maybe you can be late to say, oh, cool. Good. Early vision, early decision. In fact, I was, I was in a lesson last week, and somebody, I don't know what they'd done, but they came and went straight into the parked car, which you're going to see on the left. The, park, the car was parked, and the car just drove into it, this one here. Just drove into the car. Like, what happened? A student? No, no, uh, just a normal person. Oh. They hit it hard. Full, with a full driving license. Hopefully, it wasn't a provisional. That's quite a big impact. Yeah, That's Dave. about 30 miles an hour That's at least. It. Yeah. yeah. That's a big impact. Definitely. How do they pick up so much speed coming off the roundabout? It's not far, is it? Like, they must have really put their foot down. Yeah, definitely. Did you see what kind of car hit that car? Was it it's like Nissan Nis Nis Micro? No way. You're joking. Versus the BMW. Mate, that is not a good advert no. for BM. No. If that was a Range Rover, it probably would have just bounced off. There you go. <laughs> it's made of plastic. Yeah. Someone's spending 70 grand on a plastic car. Come on. Right. Roundabout, turn left, first exit. Okay. 
And then Desmond, a little bit further down the road, we have some black and white chevrons. Yes. And just where those black and white chevrons are, there is an entrance to a car park. What I'd like you to do is turn left into the car park okay. where the black and white chevrons are, please. Everybody that's watching at home, oh my god. Look at this. This is so slightly narrow. slightly positioned outwards to give myself <coughs> enough space to scoop it in so I don't take off Scott's door. Wow. Turning left again, please, under the barrier, mm -hmm. entering into the car park. And as you go into the car park, Desmond, I'd like you to choose any bay and drive forwards into it, please. So okay. forwards bay park. Okay. Stressful, isn't it, Des, when you're in a different car? You're like, hang on a second. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't right. I thought you were going behind that Merc. The silver one. No, he's, he's sticking over. Oh, he's it's got, got a big bump. He's got a bump. He's got a nudge bar. Nah, yeah. so I'll pick this one. This is easier. Foot automatics don't roll backwards. They don't if you're firmer on the brake because you're very gentle oh, with okay. your feet. It okay. can roll a little so bit. I didn't, I didn't yeah. want to headbutt you. <laughs> yeah, which examiners don't like. Okay, I'm happy with that. Nice. Yep. This one here, I don't mm -hmm. know why it keeps falling down. Can you just give it a little nudge up again? Yeah, see, it's that one there, but it's tight, isn't it? Tight now, it's moved now. Oh, did I yeah. move it the wrong so way? So which way should I need to go? This yeah, that's way? good, just leave it like move that. Way. That's cool. cool. Yeah, okay. all right. All right, nice manoeuvre. Thank you very much. What I'd like you to do next mm -hmm. is reverse out, um, because we need to do a reverse bay park. Okay. Yeah, maybe... Mm. Go forward through the middle. Uh, they're over there yeah. doing this rubbish, yeah. so um, I let's can, wait. I can, I can back the car up mm -hmm. to you. Yeah, that's what then, I was and thinking, then, and then do a chords. Yeah. yeah, let's do that. Cool. Right, so when you're ready, reverse cool. out to the left, cool. please. That's a nice little Renault. Mm. I like these little cars now, they, yeah. they're really cool. Have you seen the Nissan, oh no, the Honda? Yes. The electric. Yeah. Yes, I think it's, it's like, a HRV. It looks, like it looks like a RDD2. Yeah, the small one, yeah? yeah? The small so one. cool. Yeah. All right, Desmond, put yourself yeah. into a position yeah. uh, for reverse bay park. Okay. And you choose any side. You okay. obviously won't be doing this at West Wickham, nope. but nope. we'll do it anyway. Yep. So when you're ready, I'd like to reverse bay okay. park. Cool. Mind the camera, mind the camera. <laughs> Why are you rolling your window down? Because the cat. Oh, yeah, right, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, because I'm going to go on this side. But yeah, okay, I remembered, yeah, yeah. Oh, yes, because your camera's on the... Yeah, I've done that too many yeah. times before. <laughs> what happens when it goes down? Oh, it falls off. Doesn't the, doesn't the window go back up? Because I'm mirroring... No, so... it just clips it off. Okay. Maybe it would go back up, I don't know. But it, it hasn't in the past. everybody the camera which is gone now right that was a good maneuver right when you're ready desmond i'd like you to exit the car park going through the barrier on the right hand side again for me please now what's a good tip here with this move to the left side, right and that, that gives me observation to the right Good. Yeah, I think this guy lives here, so... Lovely, well done. Yeah, so, yeah. Lucky, very nice yeah, house. Yeah, yeah. I think he might be the caretaker for the park. Okay. He looks a bit, yeah. Caretaker, caretaker yeah. Look. Yeah. Okay, at the end of the road, turn right. Okay. Now, we're taking care here because there's a possibility that someone could I'm try in. to enter, yeah. yeah. That's it. It's a really so difficult forward. car park. Lean to be keen. Creep and peep. Good. And with this road, people tend to go a little bit more than the speed limit, so there's no risk trying to come out the junction. So take your time, basically, yeah. 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 Walk across, drive across. Nice, thank you. And just continue to follow the road ahead, please, so at the roundabout straight second exit. Yeah, 
it's always better to be at slightly under the speed limit because it's not a target, it's a speed limit. So some people think you have to do 30 miles an hour spot on. Very good. You don't have to. Right, I'm going to give you a second chance. Mm-hmm. When it's safe, I'd like you to try and impress us with your manly beep on the horn, please, Desmond. Whee! Pretend I'm in a big... What do you call those big trucks, like juggernauts? Yeah, HGVs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You've actually, you can change your horn again. I a, know, a I'd love to do that. People. Okay, what I'd like to do is go straight. Second exit, please. Okay. So not a right turn, straight ahead. Straight ahead, okay. please. Second exit. Cool. Here, Desmond changes his direction to the left and does not check his mirror before doing so. This is a driver fault for mirror checks of change of direction. An early vision, early decision. Cool. Gonna hold the middle of the roundabout. Good. This new road, new rules. Check mirror. Just park cars. Most people, when they come down, they would be driving in the cycle lane to compensate for us coming towards them. Not oh, all right, the time, I see that. Most yep. people okay. will keep in the cycle lane. So we've got the cycle lane on the left yeah. there. So uh, the, sorry, on the right. Yeah, so yeah. the Jag's moving over now. See? Good. Yep. Yeah. And you're holding that one meter, the yep. door width yep. from the yep. left. Yep, check behind me. Nice. Yep. Mitsubishi. Well done. If it's safe, I'd like to pull over on the left, please. Thank you very much. And some part of the test usually asks you to stop on the left on a semi-busy road mm-hmm. like that, don't mm-hmm. Okay, yeah. so when you're ready, I'd like to drive on. It's the part of the test that we're completing now. Yeah. Right, good. The way they stop you, they have to be some kind of challenged. It won't be a deserted road. There have to be some... some Realistic yeah, road, yeah, right? Yeah, Because yeah, yeah, you're going to yeah. stop here and move yeah, away yeah. at some point yeah. when you're past your test, yes, so life, we right. want to see that you're able to do that, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, that was another question I was going to ask. Uh, I can't remember what it was now. Right, okay. At the traffic lights, I'd like you to turn left, please. First exit. Uh, sorry, turning left at the yeah. traffic lights. It's not a roundabout. And you know what, all of this, like, when I'm driving around so where, here... Where's this, where's this camera? Where is it? Where this is one, it? This one. I thought you were going to ask why yeah, it came this one, on. This one. So this camera is just hidden in up oh, here. okay, yes. yes. So that one comes on to help you see the traffic lights. Yeah. Makes sense, yeah. Because sometimes you... Yeah. <laughs> Desmond's looking out the window and going... Yeah, uh? I think that's already. <laughs> I understand. Uh? And it gives you information in front, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, just sometimes, yeah. you know, you're a bit close to the light. It can be a bit hard to see through that yeah. blind spot okay. up here. I see. Right, yeah, so I get flashbacks of lessons with you, actually, around mm-hmm. here, showing me the roads yeah, and stuff. Yeah. So just before the roundabout, turn right. The next road on the right, please. The orders. Nice. I'm going to enter the hatchet markers nice and early. All right. Desmond likes to go on these hatch markings early to get safe position. And cameras like to die quickly. Yeah, and check up the road, meeting road. Have a check. New road, new rules. It is a 30 miles an hour. Green lamppost, Bromley. But I'm going to stay at 20, 25. No more than 25 to suit the condition. Holding in the middle of the road. Alpha male, dominating the road. Okay, checking behind me. I'm just going to move over. And then when I stop, I don't give myself enough room from the transit. Very good, yeah. A lot of people put themselves too tight, yeah, don't they? That's right. And then they can't see when they come out. And then the car behind thinks they're, they're parking. Take Starts the next road on the right, please. Okay. 
Scott remembers these roads. Oh well. yeah, mate, don't mm. worry. I was doing my two-day pass down here. Mm-hmm. It's a good place to do the two-day pass, it is, guys. Yeah. Especially with Desmond, I'm not going to lie. Like, you don't want you don't want me down here for two-day pass. Trust me. <laughs> <laughs> Bring Desmond. Yeah, it's expensive to bring him down from... from no, not really even down. that. I just think you'll stand a much better chance yeah. with Desmond yeah, at West Wrecker than me. Yeah, because yeah. Desmond knows people. Yeah. yeah. And, um, yeah, so just give Desmond a call. Yeah. Number's down in the description. Two-day pass at Pinna. Full spot. I'm talking too much, actually. We're not past it yet. we still got this bend, don't we? Okay, mm. cool. Uh, yeah, cool. I remember this bend. Mm-hmm. And then I think it's probably the next road on the That's left. Correct. Yeah. So I like yes. to say next road on the left, please. Lakewood Avenue. We're almost back. Just going to oh, pop out some manoeuvres real quick. And then we'll give Desmond his result. Mm. Ah! Desmond, I'd like to pull over and stop on the left, please. Just behind the silver car. Do not worry about the driveway on this occasion. So anywhere on the left will do. Okay. What we're going to do is a reverse park exercise. I'd like to move out, stop next to the car in front, parallel to it, then reverse park within two car lengths and a reasonable distance from the curb. There is a driveway on this occasion. Disregard the driveway, so you'll be allowed to stop in front of the driveway if necessary. Mm -hmm. When you're ready and it's safe, move out, stop next to the car, and I'd like to reverse park. Thank you. Okay. Checking all around. I'm gonna go back till I see the end of the vehicle in the window. There's the end of the vehicle. I'm gonna do my first blind spot check and then my first right, my first left turn, which I teach to one to one. Jumping, cool. Then I'm gonna go one and back, check again the blind spot. Then it's gonna go back till that little marker is on the curb which will be my black dot, then I'll turn right again, and then I'm home and drive. That's the tree's probably picking up. Cool. Keep forgetting to show yeah. people the camera. Mm. And then do my last turn left, looking behind me. Cool. Right, very nice. When you're ready and it's safe, drive on please. And if it's safe, I'll put my hand up and ask you to do a controlled stop. Mm-hmm. So my signal will be stop, Right, okay. when you're ready, okay. drive on. Good if I put into <laughs> drive, innit? <laughs> See the manual and the auto, man. It's amazing how your brain has to. Yeah. You know what I was doing the other day? I was doing this. Did you? In my wife's car. Did you manage to learned. pull it off? Yeah. You can do left foot yeah, braking. Yeah, easy. No way. Yeah, yes way. I can't do it. I did it. May I? Poo my pants no, every time I, did it. I try. You get used to it. You, you gotta okay. just yeah. Be yeah. be ready. Mm-hmm. Um. Stop. Drive on when you're ready. Okay. Thank you very much. We will not ask you to do that again. I'd like to do your last manoeuvre and pull over and stop on the right, just in front of the next black vehicle on the right side of the road. Okay, don't worry if you stop a little bit in front of the driveway again. On this occasion, disregard driveways. Thank you very much. What I'd like to do is reverse back roughly two car lengths, keeping into the straight line, and finish a reasonable distance on the curb. Which okay. one did that noise? Is that one beeping at us? I don't know what one that was. All right, anyways, when you're ready and it's safe, I'd like you to reverse back roughly two car lengths. Okay, thank you very much, and drive on when you're ready, please. Should put it in drive this time.
Right, to pull over on the left and leave about a car length from the next vehicle, please. So just before the driveway would be perfect. And drive on when you're ready. This is called the angled start, and this is why we're doing this. It's part of the test, because a lot of people, especially manual cars, will jump the clutch and go flying over there into the parked vehicles on the right side of the road. So this is a test of skill, isn't it? To see yes. how you control the vehicle as you move off. Slow steering. Yeah. That's it. Quick, quick, slow Girl. on your steer. Was, was it quick feet? No. Slow on your feet, quick on the steering. Okay, there you go. Never heard that one. So learning lots slow and lots hands. of things. Yeah. Okay, uh, is it left, Des? It is. Yep, turning left, please. Thank you very much. And is it one of the roads? Oh, no, we've got to do a little wiggle, don't we, to get through? Yeah, we can have go straight down or we could take, yeah. That will take us to the hills, that will take us to the centre straight ahead. Alright, straight ahead then, we're going back to Tessa now. We're just going to finish off just on the roads, like where you'd yeah, finish off yeah. on your driving test. Yeah. Okay. So I think it's at the end of the road, turn right, then yes. turn left, That's isn't correct. it? Yeah, yeah. So, so this is your independent drive. Yeah. Like to remember the directions, Des. Turn yeah. right, then turn left, yeah. alright? Yeah, it's not hard. Do they still do that? Yes. They do still do that. They so do. they ask you to remember a set of directions, yes, yeah? Yeah, cool. yeah. Double command, because obviously the, the right is immediately after this. The left, after, mm -hmm. turn right, left. They're immediate, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, so they're quite, mm -hmm. so they give you a double command. Cool. Did you say turn right, turn left? Yes, please. <laughs> okay, let's Just check. good, yeah, you'd clarify, yeah, yeah, innit? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. yeah. you could go the other way, Yeah, you could go oh, the way yeah. that car just come out. Yeah. yeah. All right, yeah. nice one, yeah. You know what? That was actually the plan I had, but it doesn't matter because they're both roads yeah, that you'd yeah, finish on anyway. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's good. A lot of people fail here when they they when they turn le left, they go they go on the other side of the road too early. That Jag's been parked here about a while now. That Jag. Mm. Mm. It's all right. Yeah. It looks like it's not abandoned. No, it's here. Yeah. And it's very hard to find spaces yeah. to park down here. So the examiner it? will recommend, he'll tell you to slow down. He'll tell you where to, yeah. Because okay. he obviously wants to finish you up. So he, he takes control of where the okay. situation is. Okay. So what I'd like you to do is pull over and stop in front of the blue car or here, wherever it does. You're yeah. more than yeah. capable yeah. of stopping yeah. in yeah. wherever you like. So blue car would be nice. All right, amazing. Thank you very much. And just switch the engine off. And you know the driving test is over when you switch the car off. Yep. Right? Okay. Yep. Okay. And I'm going to ask you to relax and you talk to take your seatbelt off and just chill until you finish the marking. All right. So that is the end of your driving test. Yeah. And congratulations. You yes. failed your driving yeah. test. Am I really? Yeah. Where? Would you like me to tell yeah, you? Yeah, tell me. Okay. So, um, one serious driver fault yeah, really? for what I failed on my driving test. Yeah. Now, if I'm wrong, well, I'll go back in the cool. editing and make yeah, sure that yeah, I'm not cool, wrong because cool. I might be wrong because cool. it's my weakness. Yeah, cool. Do you remember what my weakness yeah, is? Yeah, speeding. Yeah. Yeah? So, remember where we were talking about that 40 mile yes, an hour I sign? Remember, yeah. I did thought so. Yeah, go on. We yeah. were above it, weren't yeah. we, before yeah. we reached. But, so. but the sat nav said, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. Sat nav was misleading you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And that's yeah. put me in hot water before. Yeah, yeah. So it's really important that people do know yeah. that sometimes the sat navs yeah. or technology yeah. might yeah. mislead yeah. you slightly, yeah. whether it's an update yeah. or yeah. whatever yeah. reason. Yeah. 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 So continue to keep looking for signs. Still something that I have to constantly keep yeah. reminding myself yeah. to yeah. do. Um, so on this occasion, for the reason that we were above the 30 yeah. limit by a fair bit. Yeah, 35. Oh, yeah. yeah, sorry. Okay, um, then it was a serious driver fault yeah. on that occasion. Yeah. Okay. Um, other driver faults, so the regular driver faults are advisory driver faults, depending on how you want to explain mm -hmm. them. We try not to say minor and major faults. Yeah. We try to avoid saying yeah. that, but a lot of the public will say yeah. that. Yeah. Okay, we're told not to. Yeah. All right, anyway, so the minor driver faults, if you like, one, two, three, four. I'll try to do them in order. Yeah. Um, so the order would be the... 
first one, uh, just a little bit over the speed limit on the Mad Mile. So it's just a driver yes. for 42 yeah. miles yeah. an hour on the Mad Mile. Mm -hmm. I hope this shows it because yeah. it's a little bit on and yeah. off, but the car yeah. is showing that. Um, okay, then we're going into the uh, bike lane. Uh, yes. You did go in the bike lane. There wasn't any bicycles, mm -hmm. but was it necessary to go into the bike lane? Was it coming up the... Yeah, I don't know what road it was. Yeah, you, okay. you had more knowledge yeah, yeah, than I yeah, do. Okay. But everybody in front of us yeah. was kind of out of it. Yeah, we yeah, were in it. Yeah. You know, we didn't yeah, cause yeah, any yeah, no bike nuisance. There's yeah, yeah. no bike. Yeah. But on that occasion, yeah. I just marked it down as okay. a driver fault no because problem. I've just heard examiners say it in the past. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So unless it's really necessary, yeah. try to keep out the bicycle yeah. lane. Mm -hmm. uh, then we went into doing our forward bay park. Yeah. And the car rolled a little yes, bit, so very did. gentle on the brake, right, right. which is an excellent habit yeah, to have. Yeah. Um, so the car just rolled a little bit back, so it's yeah. a driver fault for the control. Mm -hmm. um, and then we're moving on to the last one now. There was a roundabout where I asked you to go straight ahead. The sign said Shirley, and you were like, straight ahead? You sure not turning right? Yeah. And I was like, no, straight ahead. And you moved over to the left lane. Congrats, yeah. you need to do that, yeah. use the left yeah. lane. Yeah. Yeah. As you change direction to the left, I can be wrong, that's yeah. why I'll yeah. check the yeah. edit, yeah. Yeah. but I didn't see a mirror check to okay. the left on that occasion, okay. so just move yeah. it back into the left. Okay. That is it. Yeah. Before Desmond punches me in the face, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm going to say... I wouldn't do that. <laughs> I'm Scott, this is Desmond. Stay yeah. safe, Dick. Stay tuned. Yeah. And I think we both yeah. need to go and have yeah. dinner or something. Yeah. I'm yeah. Yeah. Dinner yeah. Now. Yeah. All right. Yeah. And um, we'll see you next time. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah.